Hi everyone, welcome to Clinical Tips. I'm Kevin and I'll be your host on this episode talking about red blood cells component of a complete red blood cell count or CBC test. Imagine you're the primary care physician at a local hospital when an ambulance brings a 32 year old man after a car accident. He has multiple injuries. After quickly assessing the patient condition, you proceed to stabilize and resuscitate the patient. Vascular access are established and blood samples are taken. On this case, we're gonna focus our attention on three red blood cells parameters, erythrocyte count, hemoglobin, and hematocrit. Our patient has a erythrocyte count of 2.9, a hemoglobin of 9.2, and a hematocrit of 28.2%. But what does this really mean? Reference values for erythrocyte count for an adult man go from 3.9 to 5.5. Our patient has a erythrocyte count of 2.9. On a trauma patient where we suspect hemorrhage, erythrocyte count might be the first red blood cells parameter to be depleted. In this case, we think our patient is losing blood, so immediate treatment is needed. Reference values for hemoglobin of an adult man go from 12.6 to 17.7. Our patient has a hemoglobin of 9.2. This might indicate hemorrhage or a pre-existing anemia. In this case, we will think that it's more because of a hemorrhage. Reference values for hematocrit on an adult man go from 42% to 50%. Our patient has a hematocrit of 28.2%. This again indicates ongoing hemorrhage and we need to act fast to save this patient's life. Depending on the patient presentation, blood cells parameter might indicate different conditions. We hope today you have learned how to interpret these values on a trauma patient. See you next time.